Hey, welcome to the latest edition of Hurricane Golf TV. I'm here with Boys 11 to 14 champion Kyle Spencer. Shot a two day total of 151. Uh, Kyle, the wind was uh, kind of picking up and swirling throughout the day today. Uh, how'd you deal with that? And, and uh, what uh, what was the biggest thing that you had to deal with? Um, well, like a lot of times it would change, make sure, you know, you change clubs like halfway through your shot because, you know, it would change distances, just how we play. Um, a lot of people would, you know, fly and come up short because the wind was swirling a lot. And um, it really got difficult out towards some of the holes on the marsh where it um, really picked up out there. Yeah, four, five and six played real tough today. Uh, do you have any favorite holes out on the course today? Um, I really like number, uh, really like number one today. Uh, I also liked number nine. That was a fun hole. Just, you know, something fun happened there. And was fun. Yeah. All right, boys 11 to 14 champion Kyle Spencer, congratulations. Right, I'm here with boys 15 to 18 champion Ewan Ferguson from Scotland. Shot 200 par this weekend. Uh, seems like every time you enter one of our tournaments, I'm congratulating you and uh, handing you the first place trophy. Uh, what do you can contribute to all the success you're having out here with us? Um, well, I practice hard, so I guess you get what you practice, how hard I practice, I guess I get rewarded for it. Um, the, the GPGA also helped me a lot, but I don't give enough credit to my coach back home, Gregor Monk, uh, my national coach, has helped me a lot. and. Probably if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't, I wouldn't even be in the States winning tournaments as well, so I'm grateful for that. Yeah, I'd also like to thank the Titleist rep, uh, Scott Morrison, for sorting out all my kit and stuff like that, because obviously you look good as well. You, I feel as if you can play a bit better, which is nice. <laughs> Alright, sounds good. And uh, you were the only one to shoot under par both days. Uh, what do you think you did differently from the rest of the field? What, what made you have such success out here? Um, well, it was it was it was been windy the last couple of days. Today more so than yesterday. It was um, it was swirling a little. So obviously being from Scotland, I'm used to the wind. I'm, I can flight it low. I can shape it both ways, and uh, I think that definitely had an advantage over the other competitors. And uh, I think that's what, that's what managed me to get on top. All right, sounds good. Well, until next time, congratulations. Cheers. Boys 50 18, 18, 18 champion, champion Izzy Cabedo. She shot a two-day total of 150, 100 par today. Uh, Izzy, you shot 79 on the first round. You shot 71 today. Uh, what would you do differently from round to round uh, to, to improve by so much? Um, I putted really well today. Yesterday, I didn't make too many putts for birdie or par. But today, I hit, I hit a lot of greens. I hit like 15 greens. And uh, what was your confidence level coming into uh, to round two, uh, thinking you can go ahead and, and take the championship? Um, well, I, was, I started one shot back today, and I started with eight straight pars. So I wasn't too confident but because I wasn't making any birdies yet. But then I got to number nine, and then I made two birdies in a row, and that's what fired it up. All right. Well, congratulations.